Hello everyone, my name is Michelle Sanchez, also known as Evil Hemi on Xbox Live. Welcome to my channel where I bring you video game commentary, tips and tricks and strategies and rants and raves from an older woman's perspective. I hope you enjoy the show. So today's map is a map called Event and it is located in London, England. And it is a medium sized map and it's a small rock uh, stadium and it's actually very nicely done and really fun to play on. So I've spawned back here in what we call the park or the back side of the map, uh, which is overlooking what I believe is the Thames River in London, England. And I really like this map, you know, for a couple of reasons. One, that it's really nicely laid out. It's got a lot of nice detail. And two, I've actually been to London, England, you know, and that large Ferris wheel in the background there, that is called the Eye of London. And I've actually ridden that myself. It's a lot of fun. So I'm running back behind the cafe and, you know, past a couple of teammates and I noticed that one of our team is AFK or AFC. He's away from the console. He's not playing. And somebody from the enemy team has mooched a kill. So that is the new term for the day, mooch. You know, to mooch a kill means that there's somebody in the game that you come up upon that obviously isn't playing and you run up to them and you get the kill and take them out. That's a, a mooch, a freebie, a gimme. And they should be enjoyed at, uh, to their fullest and you should take advantage advantage of those at every opportunity. So I run through the men's room up to the uh, hottest spot on the map and this is this little concrete pad out there with the park benches that intersects between the men's room, the concession stand and the spectator window uh, that's directly in front of this concrete pad. And my turtle beaches are picking up on somebody in the bathroom and I wait them out, wait for them to run by so I can take them out here. And when you're playing up on this side of the map, you got people that are coming at you from the left and from the right and from the center there, so you really got to be on your toes. Uh, so you take them out before they take you out. And I'm back in the men's room and reloading my gun and calling in my UAV, and I hear some activity outside here. I go out to help my teammate, and I get concussed, and I immediately drop to the ground. Waiting for my senses to recover so I can get up and rejoin the fight or at least go back to uh, to the other side of the map to what we call a pinch point or a choke point. And that's this little cafe area here. That little door there and the sidewalk that's to the left of that door. Those are pinch points or choke points where people actually funnel through there. And if you're uh, in the right place at the right time, you can actually pick off quite a few like I'm doing here with this fellow. So I'm reloading my gun and I'm going to take another stroll down this choke point here and I run into half the enemy team. Boom. I get gang bang. Insta punished. You know, there's no way I'm going to survive that. So I respawn back at the concession stand and I'm working my way back up to the hot spot here and putting out the bouncing Betty and get a kill there. Now. I live near the Oakland Coliseum, you know, where the Raiders play in the Oakland A's, and they've got some, they've got uh, uh, what they call a Coliseum dog, and it, it's not your ordinary Oscar Mayer wiener. This dog is plump, delicious, tasty, juicy, and every time I run through this concession stand, it makes me want a Coliseum dog. You know, <laughs> so I'm waiting this guy out here and I'm trying to play a careful game because I want my dragon fire. I don't want to just jump out there and risk getting killed. I want to add to my uh, to my list of kills, you know, so I can get my kill streak award. And I take this guy out. Now, this poor guy, this check of four, I think I take him out eight different times in this game. And I feel really bad. And I'm probably the only person on Xbox Live or Call of Duty that feels bad for repeatedly taking the same person out over and over again. I'm not even trying to take this guy out. And he keeps coming at me with a knife, you know. And I don't know if he's trying to get, you know, gold knives or diamond knives or what the deal is. But, you know, every time I encounter this poor guy, I kill him and I feel really bad. And my friends are like, don't feel bad, Hemi. You know, don't feel bad. He was going to kill you anyway, right? So I'm in the bathroom and I'm reloading my gun and, you know, take him out again. Sorry, Cheka. <laughs> and it gets me to thinking, you know. This is a pretty clean men's room, you know. And the answer is yes, uh, you know. Michelle Hemi Sanchez has been in her fair share of men's rooms, uh, quite by accident though, you know, in my lifetime. Uh, once was at the movies, uh, you know, walking out of the movies, checking my cell phone, reading messages and following the herd, so to speak, and walk through the door and look up and happen to see about a dozen guys standing at the urinals looking at me with very strange looks on their faces. And I couldn't get out of there fast enough, right? So the men's room on this map is very clean. It's much cleaner than what I expected it to be. Which leads me to uh, another point, you know. If I am a lady and I come to this arena on the map called Event and I have to make the pee-pee, 
where do I go? You know, there's no ladies room on this map. There's none in the concession stand. There's none in the cafe. There's certainly not any outdoors, uh, so to speak, just the men's room. You know, so I guess I could I could come back here in the park area and use the trees or the bushes, but that would be quite messy, you know. So no room for us ladies to do our thing, you know, to do our business on the map called event. You know, you guys are really lucky. You know, you guys that are watching, uh, you know, you, you take it out, you do your business, you give it a shake, you put it back, and you're done. You know, not so with us ladies. We've got to disengage from everything that we're carrying. You know, we've got to remove our clothes. We've got to find a place to sit down or at least squat. You know, and then when we're done, we've got to clean up. You know, we've got some housekeeping to do before we put our pants back on. So much easier for you guys to do that than for us. So Cheka 4, this is the only time he kills me in the game, and he and he kills me because he catches me unaware. You know, I happen to run through the men's room, and I see him on the ground, and he's wiggling around down there on the floor, and I'm wondering, what in God's name is this guy doing? And bang, I'm dead. Which leads me to uh, another thought about uh, Call of Duty. You know, it's the distractions on the map. You know, the things floating around, the butterflies that float across my scope when I'm trying to snipe somebody and I get killed because it's like, oh, look, a butterfly or some decoration on a yacht or some flowers on Mirage or whatever the case may be. And I'm kind of thinking, well, maybe that's kind of like, you know, the effect that boobs have on guys. You know, you're out there in the garage talking cars with your homies and somebody with a pair of boobs walk by and everybody's mouth just kind of drops open and you you forget what you're talking about you just kind of stop talking and you know boobs bang <laughs> anyway the game is over it's 75 to 42 and we do a really good job of smacking these guys down and I actually do pretty decent on this map you know even though it's new and uh, you know I'm not that good of a player um, and nothing really of import has happened on this map it's just that I like it you know it's London it's a place that I've been to and you know and I've ridden the eye of London and I just kind of wanted to share that with you today so thanks for stopping by and checking out my channel and watching my game film. Have a good day or evening wherever you happen to be watching from. Take care and I'll see you on the battlefield. Hemi out.